Let's just go back to 2018 in in December of 18, several years ago. Um, I started to resent my kids, and I would say to, I would say out loud and or in my head, I would say, you know, I would be making so much more money if I didn't have kids. I would say I wish I didn't have kids. I would say um, I'm only able to work, you know, 12 hours a day because I've got my kids and. Uh, you know, I've, I've got to do this. And I, and basically the 12 hours a day means that I would wake up pretty early and you'd get a little bit of work done, maybe get an hour, hour and a half of work. Then I would be, you know, a dad and I'd, I'd feed the kids or get them to school and then I would work and then they, I'd pick them up from school. And then, um, I do homework with them, make sure that they do their baths. I would cook them their food and then I would, um, put them to bed. And then I would work from, let's call it eight o'clock. That was, that was their bedtime back then. Now it's nine 15. Uh, but back then it was 8 AM, 8 PM, 8 PM was bedtime. And, the, and so after eight, maybe sometimes eight 30, that's when I would be able to work again. And I'd be able to work, um, all the way from like eight 30 until, uh, one or two in the morning. And so that's how I got my 12 hours at the time. I, you know, it's like I'm running my side business or whatever. The point is I made a conscious effort to practice gratitude or express gratitude to, um, to do that every morning before getting out of bed and to do it every evening. Um, once I get into bed, but before going to sleep that I would, I would just think about the things I was grateful for. So I, I kind of switched in uh, my mindset and I just was like, I love my kids. I'm grateful for my kids. I'm glad I have kids. I didn't think that I would be able to have kids short story story time. Um, I had been married for a few years. We had never gotten pregnant. And so I got tested and I had less than a 1% chance, less than a 1% chance. And then I was able to have children. Luckily, like a miracle, right? Less than a 1% chance that I had and it happened. And why am I being the person who's like, oh, I wish I didn't have them. Uh, I would be doing so much better if I didn't have them or why did I have to have them right now? Or they're holding me back even. It was just a wonderful chance to be able to understand like how freaking grateful I am, how lucky I am, how blessed I am. And this is what I always wanted. And here I am thinking that I need to work and make a million dollars a year and, and then I'll be enough to be able to be a good dad. And I, and I kind of got this, um, epiphany, this role reversal, this, uh, this idea changed in my head where it was like, no, I get to be a dad. Now you only have them for 18 summers, right? You only have them for a certain amount of years. And that time is going fast. And it was like, no, this is what I always wanted. This is what I'm grateful for. And and of course, I would express gratitude for other things like the roof over my head, like the car that I drove, like the relationships that I had that helped me in business, the um, amount of people that came to my events, listen to my podcast, et cetera. It's like there's so much that I can be grateful for because I'm doing a good thing in the world. And so that's what I'm asking you to do. 